Hello, I'm Sister Rosemary Greco, and we're sitting here at Wisdom House with Susan Iadone, who's here for a recorder workshop. A Wisdom House a Retreat and Conference Center spends much of its time with a focus on spirituality, education, and the arts, and this recorder workshop fits right into our mission. So I'd like to ask you, Susan, could you tell us something about the recorder workshop, the medieval recorder workshop that you are conducting this weekend? Well, we're really doing medieval music, Renaissance music, Baroque music, and a bit of music beyond that. Anything that works well for the recorder, we do. And when I say we, I have what I think is the world's best faculty at any recorder workshop, any place. Um, all wonderful friends of mine, terrific musicians, fabulous coaches, and this is why people keep coming. This is our 10th year. This is why people keep coming to these workshops. Our faculty is Karen Snowberg, Sheila Beardsley, Susan Hellauer, Larry Lipnick, and Larry Zukoff. We've never changed faculty. This is it. And we have a very intensive program where people come not to learn technique, but simply to work on concert music, ensemble music, learn how to work better in a group. And they will incidentally pick up techniques for improving their playing. But it's not so much for individual instruction and individualized learning. It's learning how to work well in a group, play music together. Can you, can you tell us something about the, the types of medieval music or, or uh, instruments? The instrument. Well, it is a recorder workshop, so the focus is on all different sizes of recorder from sopranino through great bass, contrabass. But the faculty plays other instruments aside from the recorder. We, many of us play viola da gamba, different sizes of viola da gamba. Susan Hellauer plays Renaissance guitar. Karen Snowberg plays Renaissance brass instruments, although we don't have them here. Everybody except me sings. <laughs> this is a blessing. <laughs> That's my public service, I do not sing. Um, so when we put on a faculty concert, it's not just recorders, but we have recorders, viols, singing. So it's, it's a more interesting concert. I, I must say, when Susan was here last year and offered the concert in our chapel, it was just a unique experience and something that no one should miss. Uh, they, the group will be offering a concert this evening, but they'll also be offering a concert in June when they return for another workshop, so people might want to keep an eye on the Wisdom House website to see when, they're, when they'll be returning. Hello, I'm Larry Zukoff. I actually am, uh, in, when I'm not here at the workshop, I'm the director of a community art school in New Haven, Connecticut that serves many different people of all ages, all different kinds of music and instruments. But here in my professional world, I'm a recorder player and a singer primarily, um, I, we, we often do workshops with a great range of players, people who are very experienced and advanced, and people who have just been starting out, and people in between. And the world of the recorder workshop is uh, comprised of uh, a wonderful opportunity for people to come together and experience music making with other people, as Susan mentioned, and actually open up the world of this vast repertoire from pre-Bach, uh, as well as some things that are later. But it's a many centuries of music, and it's beautiful music, as um, Sister Rosemary alluded to, and it's wonderful for people who have find, through the recorder, an opportunity to access this music and uh, play with others. My name is Larry Lipnick, and I'm um, a professional recorder player, viol player, singer, and one of the things that I love about this workshop is the wonderful collection of people from many different areas that come together to not just share the music and repertoire that they love, but also make music together. And it's a wonderful communal experience. Hi, I'm Karen Snowberg. I'm the music director for the Westchester Recorder Guild and do a, quite a bit of private recorder teaching and with different groups around the New York metropolitan area. And I uh, really enjoy working at these weekend workshops because it gives uh, not only a chance to work with the people individually, but you also get acquainted with your students as well. So and it seems like the same group of people comes every year, so we have a good time 
going over our years' experiences with each other, and it's nice to see how people have developed also musically throughout the year. So. I'm Sheila Beardsley. I live just outside the greater Boston area, and I teach at a private boys' choir school in Cambridge, Massachusetts. I direct a regional early music program in Concord, Massachusetts, and I've known Susan for more years than I can count. It's a pleasure for me to come and work with my friends and colleagues as faculty and also my friends as students because, uh, as Karen said, we see their growth from year to year, see what they've learned and what they've mastered, and help them find new tools to make better music when they go home to work with their friends. I like to choose music I like because I think they'll like it too. Hi, I'm Susan Hellauer, I'm known here as Susan H, to distinguish me from Susan I the director of this workshop. Um, I started out as an instrumentalist, did a lot of early music uh, wind instrument playing, uh, but in the last 20 years or so, I've been concentrating on singing with a group called Anonymous Four, doing mostly medieval music, but lately uh, American uh, sacred folk music as well. Um, I love teaching at Susan's uh, workshops, the weekend and the summer workshops. Uh, what I really like is the variety of people who come here, even people who are maybe have only been holding on to and blowing into a recorder for maybe a year or less. They're still talented, intelligent, curious people, and I, I like to see both sides of them. Um, my main job here is to bring in medieval music, uh, the, uh, the earlier repertoires, and uh, a lot of vocal music too, which uh, gives another side to uh, recorder playing. Well, you've heard from some of the faculty for the recorder workshop, and I just have to say that if any of you have an opportunity to experience this music, it is the most enjoyable and unique music you can experience. The other thing that happens with this workshop is it really gives us a life lesson, and it tells us that out of so much diversity comes a beautiful harmony, and what a wonderful way for us to try to live.